Crush FTP has a very powerful log viewer. It's very useful for tracking down things you're looking for for audit purposes or monitoring server events that are going on. I'm just going to give a quick overview of some of the features of the log viewer. I'm going to log in as an admin user. Go to my administration console. And I'm going to open up the log viewer in a new tab. The log viewer is real-time logging data. It has ability to filter information. It can search for information and do highlighting as well. So I'm going to search in this log. I want to highlight anything that has the text FTP in it. And I'm going to filter things down for lines that contain the word my user. Now I have a very simplified log that I'm viewing here. Right here I can see that there's a user that logged in here. It's storing a large file and that the bandwidth is being limited to 10 megabytes per second. And if I go look at my administration console, I can confirm that information is actually in action right now. Here's my user that had just logged in. We can see the transfer rate is currently at about 9 megabytes a second. And if I scroll down and look at the, the graphs, I can see the transfer rate coming in right here. The log viewer is, is updating in real time. It can scroll with activity. You can turn off scrolling. You can adjust the font, the backgrounds. You can ask it to open up a different log file. So if you have another log file on the server that you want to view, you can open up other log files and view them in real time as well. You can move through the log file. Right now we're seeing a one megabyte snapshot of the log file. This log file is only 280 kilobyte, so there's not much to see, but you could ask for a 10 megabyte snapshot of a log file. And if the log file was say 10 gigabytes, it's still not a problem. You can grab the slider and you can move around through your log file to see a different section of that log file. It gives you information in a crush FTP format of log file to tell you the rough date and times that the log snapshot that you're viewing contains. So if you're not sure where in that 10 gigabyte log file, you can keep sliding the slider until you get to the date range that you're looking for. When you're looking for items with the find method, so I'm searching on FTP and I'm highlighting green, I also want to search for my user and it's going to highlight in yellow. I'm going to clear this because that's filtering everything to only contain my user. And now you can see on the left the mini map that has all the references in yellow that contained my user and the green references that contained FTP. And I can step through them by using the next result, the next result to jump through the log file to view the different actions. So as you can see, this log viewer is more than a basic log viewer. It's real time logging all through a web browser being streamed from your Crush FTP server.